I'm up here in an unconditioned attic looking at a 75,000 BTU 80% terrine furnace. Uh, comes up here, runs up into the roof right there. Uh, gas line is three quarter inch coming in on the left hand side. It runs back and then um, out. Electric here on the floor on the right hand side. Does have a, uh, a safety pan. Um, some kind of something that's been cut and left up on the floor. Uh, coil is turned on backwards. Three inch by three quarter inch line set. Uh, that runs through here and goes down into the floor, then out through the outside. Uh, this is a condo, uh, so the line sets are in the wall. Uh, the duct work's been duct taped on. Nice look. Um, here's your return right here. You got two returns. One's about a 12 inch and a probably an 8 inch. Uh, coming in on the uh, left hand side of the furnace. Kind of say line runs down into the wall. I'm assuming the outside. Uh, I did measure from the floor. To the bottom of the ductwork, which is 56 inches. So, very small system overall. And here's some more of your ductwork on this side. And your two inches. That is an 8 inch on the front of your system. It is limited space coming across here. I do all these two by fours. And uh, once you get there with the uh, once you get to the stairs, overall the stairs measure nineteen and a half inches. If you go inside the springs, it measures 16 and a half. So to get this up, we're probably going to have to pop these uh, springs off because this unit is a 17 and a half inch wide system. Then you have the, the stairs that go all the way down. We are in the garage. Uh, so easy access. <laughs> 